and you can guarantee that he'll find the open. Both teams getting closer to the championship as we wrap up the first quarter. He wants it all going long. He almost had it. They go right, he's tackled behind the line. Wheeler, back deep to return. Booming kick. And he's teed, and on the other side, you've got to find a way to get back in it. He scrambled. He's tackled at the point. Down, and they got their eyes on that goal line. 
Glad to have you with us on the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 Halftime Show, presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. David Stave Pollock here in the studio, as always, to let a little perspective to what just went down in the first 30 minutes. This game looks like Blowout City. I don't think I'm crazy, David Pollock. I don't think it's taking up residence in Blowout City. I think it's just passing through and visiting. Uh, we might have a comeback in school in a second. Well, I think you're crazy, and you need to go to the halfway house and visit and stay for a while, because this game isn't going anywhere back the other direction. It's over. Put the limited children to bed. Go find something else a little bit more entertaining. Go open a bag of chips. You know, start another season of something else, because this one's going to wrap. There's going to be a comeback. You're saying there's a chance. That's going to do it for David and me here in the studio. Time to get you back to the game. Ready, Kurt, ready to take you home in the second half. All right, Reese and David, you guys just sit there in your easy chairs. Kurt and I have work to do here in this third quarter. Hopefully it's going to get better. He sends this one deep. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. Or just coaching staff a lot. I think the offensive coordinator should buy the defensive coordinator as well. Well, the defense has been great. There's no doubt about it. But I just think that the offense and the base have just been so conservative, so predictable. It's made it very easy for this defense to have time to do it. Got it. And it goes down quickly. He's just going to play. That'll make it 7 to 4. Let's go, Jim. Jim, please, and take it for his wideouts. Sure, it's disappointing, but this is the kind of mechanical flaw you can fix with practice and coaching. They're about four yards away here on third down. The defense will hold them as they go three out. Picture perfect defense on that cut. That's what the defense coordinator wants to see every single time. Three, the play. Williamson, he'll take the 35. He's taken down at the 48. Both squads are digging in now. Let's see what happens on this next drive. Georgia with a big advantage. Lamb here with a period. He's at the 40. To the point. He's pushed out of bounds. Right around the 14 yard line. He's got himself a 100 yard rushing performance. They say that the truly great players step up on the biggest stage, and they don't get any bigger than this. So it's first and 10 after the big run. <laughs> Let it go. That's caught by the touchdown. <laughs> and he hits the PAT. Smith ready to kick. He gets it off, but he got all of that one. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. The Buckeyes have just gone ice cold out, but they can't seem to get anything going. Right now, they just have to get the score, get the clock, just go out there and try to get a first down, try to hope to build a little bit more confidence and continuity on this offense. I hope they show some fight here and try to stay competitive. If you're really blown out, you at least want to go out swinging. The throw is complete by his receiver. From their own 25 yard line, it's second down. Throws left, the running back's got it. He's tackled at about the 33 yard line. He's tackled by the 36-yard line. That makes it first and ten. Makes a hand on it now immediately. That's a lot of time to play. Second and 15. Ball on their own 31. Quick throw out to the receiver. Incomplete. He did the receiver on the way. That makes it third and 15. It's going the other way. Right now, around the 41-yard line. It's first and 10. Ball on the 41-yard line. Georgia comes to the line. And they make the stop at the 41-yard line. That makes it 16 to 10. They'll bring it down right around the 30. First and 10. Ball on the 30-yard line. Not sure what the flag is about here. Let's get out of the field and find out. Flipping. Offense. Flipping is the call, and now they'll have to find a way to make up those yards right here. It's first down, and a lot. In the shotgun, and five wideouts. He's at the 30, fires out to his receiver, and he's taken down around the 28 yard line. Down and they need to get it down to 20. Georgia with a commanding lead. He makes it to the 28 yard line. Okay. 
The kick is up, it's got the distance, and he splits the uprights. Smith has the ball all teed up, and he's ready to kick this one. And he got all of this one, great kick. Let's see if they can shake off that pick that he tossed last time. I look for the offense to come out with the same game plan as before. You don't make changes after one play. Fires out to wide out. Apple Bay hits a 33. Just throws this one away. You know, when you feel pressure like that, the worst thing you want to do is just to throw the ball into coverage. He got away with one right there. It's great fortunate. Next time, he should just throw it away out of bounds. So it's third down, and they've got about two yards to go. They'll line up with five wide receivers. Oh, he had some steam on that throw. And down he goes. The 49 yard line. They spread the field in the gun with five wide receivers. They hook up a little. He's taken down. Right around the 34. They'll spread the field with five wide. He's on the run. Now he's going to run it. Watch out. Dive forward. Quick throw on the receiver. Big play. It's first and goal. Play is number eight on the drive. And he just gets ready. Well, I just think this quarterback's got to do a much better job of being able to read that defense and make quicker decisions. And especially when the defense starts to get pressure, you've got to either get rid of that football or check it down or take off and run it. Nine play, 75 yard drive, and a touchdown as a result. Brad, how about the guys up front? The offensive line giving the quarterback plenty of time to be able to read the defense and make the right throw. He really got a hold of that kick. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. George is just rolling along and showing no signs right now to slow down here in the third quarter. I think the big thing you're seeing right now is just the way they're playing the confidence, especially the quarterback. I think they are very, very confident with every football. They have a chance to be able to move the football down here. They continue to be able to put points up on the board. to the 37. When you're winning the ball for big chunks of yards like that, you've got something working. First and 10, on the 37 yard line. Georgia is winning big. season. A quarterback has had in school history. He's taken apart every secondary they face, and now he's got this great achievement to show for it. Which shot the defense into the way. That was a nice, nice play. It close on the ball like that. You can't teach that kind of reaction. It's just natural ability. And here's another third down. He gets out to about the 44-yard line. The defense is having a difficult time stopping this drive. Right now they're doing enough to be in situations they want to be in, but they have to finish the job. And the plays start to add up, so we'll have to see if this defense starts to look tired out there. Contest here as we head into the final season. The Bulldogs are up big. This one has been a blowout since the beginning. Hopefully, the fourth quarter will turn things around. And he throws it away. It's the ninth play of the drive. To the quarterback in the gun. Empty backfield. Five wide receivers on the right here. He's tackled. How about the 41? The sub package in there defensively, and this by wide receiver set. Gets it, and he's looking for more. And he's tackled right around the 28 yard line. Come on, 
Which row on the receiver incomplete? 
right into the face of the quarterback so eager to make the play that he failed to see the danger in that attempt and nearly gave the ball away. From their own 37 yard line, it's second down. Congratulations, young man, for his fine performance and his award for player of the game. 